He made history on Strictly Come Dancing as he became the oldest contestant to lift the Glitter Ball trophy at the age of 42. But Joe McFadden revealed he is now unemployed and single despite him winning the show during a spectacular finale on Saturday night. The Glaswegian actor's position comes after his Holby City character Rafty Lucka was dramatically killed off earlier this month. Speaking about finding himself out of work, the Strictly star said, I'm very optimistic about the future, things are looking up. I'm feeling really good and looking forward to having a really good rest over Christmas. I'm going to lie in a dark room for about a week and sleep. More than 3.1 million viewers tuned in to watch Joe make history on Saturday as he took the age record from the 2009 winner, presenter Chris Hollins, who was 38 when he won. He scored 39 for both his Viennese waltz and his shoutings, and a perfect 40 for his Charleston, placing him second on the leaderboard behind Alexandra Burke. While partner Katya Jones burst into tears as they were crowned champions, an elated Joe whooped in amazement and gushed, oh my goodness. It's completely surreal. I can't believe we did it. Not in a million years did I think we could do it. He continued, I'm so in awe of everyone who started all those weeks ago. We've become such a tight knit group, and every single one of us are winners. I love them all to bits. Turning to Katya, he added, This woman is the most amazing woman. Thank you so much for sticking with me, and persevering with me, and for being the most amazing dancer and counselor and slave driver. She's amazing, utterly amazing. The pair looked at each other in disbelief, with a sobbing Katya rendered unable to speak through her tears. She finally managed to squeal we did it, as Joe responded, I don't know how we did it, but we did it. Despite finding himself out of work, it is unlikely Joe will feel the pinch this Christmas as he is reportedly set to get a whopping £100,000 paycheck for winning the coveted Strictly title, while other contestants may only see £25,000 for their efforts. According to The Mirror, the basic standard rate for all contestants entering the show is £25,000, which rises to £40,000 if they make it to the end of October. The hefty sum will then rise by another £20,000 should they make the quarterfinals, taking the total to £60,000 the winner walks away from the competition with an extra £40,000 on top for winning the overall title, finishing the BBC show with £100,000.